Our programs here are really the leaders in workforce development in marine biotechnology. We have a $32 million aquaculture industry in eastern North Carolina and there is a tremendous potential for growth of that industry. Our program is unique because we focus on hands-on training. So students that come through the program have the laboratory skills that they would need to walk into industry. Um, they're actually able to perform the experiments, get results, learn how to interpret the data. We are a hands-on program. The heart and soul of the program is out there on the ponds. Actually growing fish, actually harvesting fish, feeding fish, doing water quality analysis, uh, seeing, recognizing, and treating disease problems. Our program has focused on um, the culture of algae for about the last four years as an application to biotechnology. We uh, are able to produce very dense cultures of microalgae, uh, single-celled colonial microalgae for the production of algal oil for biofuel. We have outdoor facilities, uh, an 1,800-gallon system. We've successfully produced algae and biomass, extracted oil from that algal biomass, and now we're looking at to refine and optimize that process. We have uh, two options within the aquaculture program. One of the options is for students who uh, want to pursue a two-year degree and go out into the industry and go to work. Another option for students coming out of the program is transferring to a four-year institution. We have several in the region that have biotechnology programs, um, UNC Pembroke, Fayetteville State University. We have a two plus two agreement in place with the University of North Carolina at Wilmington. And students who pursue that option take courses in biotechnology as well as aquaculture. The students can transfer to the marine biology program at UNC Wilmington, earn two degrees in the normal four years time.